I got my water, so let's get started again. We are close to finishing and saving Nanako, and we will not give up until we do. I think it's good. What a sun. Oh no, sun is meh. Sun makes persona cards more likely to appear in shuffle time, which... I'm pretty much good on persona cards right now. Hellish looking, isn't it? <laughs> Maybe it's meant to be a sunset, but it just looks kind of hellish to me. Dining the dude who actually is immune to lightning. That is a good idea. It will get you far. Please continue to do so. It ain't going down. Huh, I see. It never seemed like that to me, so I didn't think of that. That. That's actually really cute. It's fine. She's used to it. We will now get money in treasure chests. Yes, I love that. 
I think once I max out Rusei and Naoto and get to the next dungeon, I'm gonna actually try and see if I can pick a fight with a Reaper. So I really said around level 65 was a good level to challenge him, and I'll be... 70-ish. How about no? as a matter of fact. That was totally weak. Okay. So it can't actually hit us with all at once. Power charge amp Megia Dolan. Look at that. <laughs> Sorji might not actually even get a shot. Nope, it's dead. <laughs> this is why you use buffs. This is why having buffs on your entire party is a good thing. <laughs> Especially when using Naoto, considering Naoto can drop mind charge Megidolans on people. Naoto really shines the most in boss fights, I think. Money, 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 money. Give me the money. Give me the money. Give me the money. Yes! Money, money. I don't even care we didn't get to use the tower. I got money. These compendium costs suck my soul. I need every single yen I can get. Awesome! 
so much delicious yen. Just imagine me like having a giant pile of all of the yen in the game and sitting on top of it like a dragon and hissing at everybody. It's my money! You can't have it! Yep. Gotta remember to do that so I don't forget again. Also, I see what you mean by sunset now that I actually know what it's supposed to be. It looks a lot more like it. For me, just because the, uh, the man took over talking took talking over from uh, Nanako, I always thought it was meant to be a very uh, uncomfortable enemies, situation. The initiative. Gross, buddy. You got something that can help us? No, but I'm going to play with you anyway. <laughs> Here's my mood on, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do about Naoto, uh, Naoto skills. I'm thinking I'm gonna replace Hamon and Mudon with their all hit versions and keep both of the boosts. While that would um, make it cost a little more, and it would leave them at sixty percent, at sixty percent, which would be the ability, which would be the current chance of the single targets I think it would help her mana conservation a lot because I'm mostly using those when the things are weak to them so what do they even need payment anyway you guys are figures of the subconscious what do you need money for Do with it. How does he get drunk at all? Oops, didn't mean to target that. This could be bad. Easy answer, Almighty. Easy answer is always Almighty. Someone finish this one off. Good move, Nato Kun. You're on a roll. Four of them. You need to thin them out. There's Sona. Maverick is not correct. And it, it literally is just as part of the test for the competition that Philmon has got with his other self. Sound like a creeper. I 
Actually, maybe they are beanstalks. This is very fairy tale looking. With the clouds being the floor and all. One enemy on the field. Let's you go. can do it. Someone finish this one Pathetic. Whoa, Kanji, that was great. I love Kanji's sneers when he actually dodges something. <laughs> Nice, Kanji! I don't know why I only did 28, but nice! Damage from it. You hit the enemy's weakness. Let's go. Someone finish this one off. It got back up. Defeat it fast. Hey, not bad, Teddy. Keep it up. Because Teddy's 137 versus Kanji's 28 is kind of significant. I don't think Teddy's magic stat and the boosts can account for all of that. That's because the all-out attack is classified as almighty damage. So anything that resists almighty will resist the all-out attack. Such a weird thing. Unique though, I'll give him that. Oh boy, Minotaurs. I couldn't defeat it. Yeah, right? Just two left. Come on, this fight's not over. Lay down and die already. You guys are not nearly fluffy enough. I love the kick. I just love the kick because it looks like it streaked the balls. Let's end this. I gained a level. Yes, her hum, a boost. And since that is basically blight but worse, we will take that. What do you think? Do you think I should go ahead and replace the single targets with the all targets since I'm mostly using them for groups of weak enemies? I do think that would be the most... SP conservative option, but I'm not sure. Mahmudon and Mahaman aren't. The all hits are dropped to 40% chance, according me. to the wiki. All yours. I, couldn't defeat I don't actually know if that's true or not, but... That said, the boost would make Just it... Two left. Come on, this fight's not over. Would make it, um... All hits with 60%, and if an enemy is weak, that's pretty much the death sentence, so... Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I don't really use it against single targets that often. I thank you. Come on now. 
So, Nanako, why are there minotaurs in your dungeon? Did you read Greek mythology in your class? Yes, I love that. I'm actually really hoping that I'll be I can get to the boss arena without having to back out and SP heal. Because if I could do that, that would be really nice. This is new. Persona. Right, along with the Kaja, I need to pick up a Dekunda somewhere. <laughs> Kanji's unfortunately fly on his butt, so he's gonna be sitting this one out. Yeah, I think I'll. He really does. He gets so upset when you tell him you can't do one. I will go with her all hits then, because I honestly think that's gonna be the best option for her. Three that had ice. Sorty doesn't matter anywhere near as much, considering he can use Victory Cry his SP back up. I would really like to get a magician and upgrade one of these personas single target dines to all target. That would be really wonderful if that could happen. It would actually be really cool if that would work for Kahulan, though he would have a useless slot in that case, but... Three enemies on the field. Be careful. Having Magaru dine would be worth it, I think. Jodan is, but they've always been on rocking horses. <laughs> they were on rocking horses in three. And 
Now they're dead, Giants. This is what you get. And we got bloody hide from the. You know what? I'm not gonna ask. Cause I don't think I really want to know the the answer, whatever the answer might be. <laughs> I got another chess key. I am Soji, the chess key god. how fast these things are. It's a pain in the butt that they can quickly put up blue wall to mark their one resistance. Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? I'll get it next time. <laughs> are way too Go get Go have way too much HP. Elimination complete. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. I like that too. I punched something. Why is it not dying? Could you not comprehend? No understand. Chess key. So many chess keys. I think I really am gonna be able to open up, uh, open up every gold chest I see from now until the end of the game. Actual floor. Anako. Once we hit that, the end of this floor, we're gonna go back and SP heal and prep for the boss. Minotaurs. Don't you dodge my giant Persona. walls of wind? Rude. I couldn't no defeat it. Left. Don't lower your guard now. Persona. I'll get it next time. <laughs> God, that angelic grace is working really well so far. <laughs> no, that's not. Uh. Penalty cards are like the worst thing. They're not even fun. <laughs> They're one of those things that just make stuff tedious and annoying. Mechanics. Run. 
Rotten mouth. Enemy down. Show him what you can. Come on, don't be a killjoy. Lay <laughs> down and die already. Go for it. Let's see a dog this. One more chance. That's what we wanted. Come on, come on, come on. EXP, EXP, EXP. Yes. Oh, if I can rush to the boss with this, that would be nice. All right, power up. And there's what we wanted. Maziodine. Yes. I've climbed the stairway to maturity. I'll recruit off a teddy as well. There's Meteor Rahan, which I would really like to have. It's actually really nice to have that before the boss, but I don't think that's going to happen, even with the moon, unfortunately. Not unless I stop to do actual grinding, and uh, I don't really want to do that. Ooh. The question is, is that anybody armor or is it just a female armor? It's a female armor. Still the stupidest decision in this game, I think, is to make armor gender locked, even though there's no cosmetic benefit to that. It's just so arbitrary. Like, there's not any actual point to doing that. It just makes Someone your party harder to well. equip. It means be, like not even actual difficulty harder, just arbitrarily harder. I'm doing shuffle time. I have the experience bonus on. I'm not replacing that for anything. Hey enemies, we have the initiative. Yeah, you're not gonna dodge this this time, huh? Well, no, that one did, but didn't really last. Enemy down. And a couple of melee attacks to finish that up. I like that too. <laughs> I need to strengthen myself too. Be 
hit its weakness. Keep it up, Move, now, Naoto Kun. Someone follow up. Please. Enemy down. Whoa, Naoto. Naoto awesome. All yours. Oh well. Uh, it's quite tenacious. Hey, not bad, Teddy. Keep it up. Just what is with those weird blocking horses? It's so creepy looking. The last four, considering pretty much everyone is capped out now. Leveled enough for the boss. I am very tempted just to find the stairs and scale up them. So I can take the moon boost into the boss. Because I feel like that would be an obscene amount of experience points. Exactly what I'm gonna do, yeah. I think that should be the stairs right here since there's no other. Small floor! Does it feel small? I don't know if it's actually small. Whoa. Quite a thing. Yep. Gonna go back, heal up, come back, save, and then we're gonna fight. Heaven we go. Also, the strategy I did for the mini boss is about the strategy I'm going to be doing for this one, if you're curious. Buff, charge, hammer, repeat. But it just works so well. some stuff, because I sure am. What's this? this is a pretty area. You mustn't go! So you were here. I guess it's true he did jump on the TV after Nanako. I don't know why it's trying to be coy about it. If you've talked to him, you know this is Namatame. <laughs> I'm going to save this girl. Also, he's got a creepy look on his Tell face. Namatame, it's definitely him. Then he did come in here. So you're the killer. Let go of her. Ah, uh, <laughs> you're the ones I saved. What? Don't worry, I'll save this girl too. 
I think you might be a bit delusional. Huh? Is this dude hide or something? Quit talking shit and let go of the girl. Don't, don't come near me. <laughs> so you're gonna save her by throttling her? Not a Kuchan. Way to go, dude. Calm down, Kanji Kun. We can't predict his behavior. We have to keep him talking. If we can discern his intentions, perhaps we can somehow deal with him. Like, he's actually strangling her. You can see her feet trembling. Also, despite this, I don't think there's actually any- despite that warning, I don't think there's actually any way to fail this section. So let's- let's keep him talking and see if we can find out more about what in the world is wrong with him. To save them. Well, he did let go. People needing to be saved appear. That's why I put them in the TV. That's... Yeah, see, see what I mean when I say it doesn't matter? <laughs> no. We must pull his attention away from Nanako-chan. I didn't have another option, Naoto. You put the people you saw on the Midnight Channel into this world, am I correct? They all want to be saved. Did I ever ask you to save me? You didn't save us, damn it! It was the exact opposite! If I hadn't put you in the TV, how would you have ended up? How would we? Are you trying to say we wouldn't have been able to face ourselves? I don't think so. What? But we nearly died! Yes. Exactly. What? You kidnapped them. Yes or no? Yes. I think this guy might be a little bit dumb. Why did you target local residents who became known through the media? Why do these people appear on the Midnight Channel? Unscrewed. On rainy nights. On TV. They signaled me. To save them. You keep saying save this and save that. You seeing murdering people is your idea of saving them? Murder? No. I'm saving them. I, mean, I guess it could be, but he doesn't seem to think what he's doing How's is that uh, different, huh? harmful. All you're doing is killing people. Which is kind of curious. <laughs> if you want to think that, go ahead. I know. You chased us all the way here to kill. <laughs> well, too bad. I'm gonna save Especially her. when he denotes we're here to kill. It seems, uh... You asshole! You're not gonna get away with this! Like, he doesn't quite realize what's going on. Shut the hell up! Uh, what? Um... <laughs> uh... <laughs> wonderful world. Um... An unknown, unreachable place filled with pleasant fog. I'm a savior! Um... It's filthy over there. So many evildoers. I think he just got possessed That's by his shadow. I'm going to save them. I'm a savior! A righteous hero! Is that... a shadow? This is new. If we don't do 
something, this could be bad. His powers are attracting more and more shadows to him. You guys got any suggestions? Look at him. He's merging with the shadows. signs yeah i'm sure you're gonna be real peaceful buddy that was definitely new though also when you listen really carefully you might notice this music is new i i'm going to save her don't so you might notice he has an interesting name. How solid is his grasp on reality? I... I'm... He's not Shadow Namatame. He actually has his own name, which is... Certainly interesting, isn't it? This one's strong. Watch yourselves. Kunino Sagiri. Something's not quite right about this. First he's possessed by a shadow, then he merges with the shadows, and now his name is actually not his name. Persona. You think so? It's an interesting uh, oh, thought there, Pi. I know. I didn't phrase it right, I'm sorry. Of course, like before. Buff to the gills. I believe he can use all of the elements, not that it helps him. Barrier change, boss. Ain't that fun. <laughs> Nanako's charm. does. I'm curious. I think his vile attack did more. Oh, it's quite horrifying. Oh, no. Ooh, you're gonna do that, huh? Alright then, you wanna play that way? We'll play that way. I mean, he didn't break them for quite a while, so uh... Persona. I wonder if he'll only use Dekaja if he gets a follow-up attack. Test that theory. <laughs> Come on down. There's Sona. Persona. 
Sorry if I'm quiet, I'm just actually concentrating. <laughs> oh, here we go. Now it starts. So elemental affinities have been shifted around. We don't actually know what's been shifted, I believe. No, it does expire it if it misses. Good to know. Ooh, lightning is now super effective. What about ice? Ooh, I should have actually hit Teddy Guard. This could actually be pretty bad. Yeah. Yes! Good Teddy! Less good for Soji. Electric attacks are more effective now. Yeah, thanks, Rise. That's helpful. I, I, I really, that's really helpful. Thanks a lot. Do we have something that has just straight Zeodyne, or do not have anything of that anymore? That's fine. Yeah! <laughs> no one said Namatame was a smart man. All yours. Luckily that quad thing does not actually affect uh, <laughs> Almighty. Yeah, he really did. I was just looking over what options I actually had. I didn't need to guard that time. The atmosphere reverted. All yours. Uh, he only uses Dekaja if provoked, or if he gets a one, one more. I don't really want to push my luck though, so I'm just gonna stick with uh, Mataru. All right, you know what? Let's do this the cautious way. Agi, huh? Well, I know how to deal with that. Soda. All yours. <laughs> that means that Teddy no longer has to be, have to be afraid of not guarding. So he's freed up to heal a bit more. Seven hundred and thirty damage, my god. Persona! I 
course, the atmosphere immediately reverted. I'm not gonna charge up yet. All yours. We'll see what this dude's actually gonna do. Come on down. They should do quad immediately again, I believe. Problem. This This is a problem. We got an issue here. Oh, do we have an issue here? like our best option and there's not gonna be much we can do against Naoto if she decides to start using uh, Mudo's and Hama's. I should have switched to Kahula and then. Oh, you liars! <laughs> Senpai, are you okay? You are dirty liars! Stepped him out of it, you jerk. Honestly, there was nothing I could have really done there because I wasn't prepared for that. And uh, hey, guess what? Kahulan's weak to ice, so Teddy would have hit me immediately. So that was um, that was just a big pain Sada. all around. <laughs> Naoto's Megia Dolan would have hit the mirror and then Teddy's ice would have hit Kahulan. I was still going down. <laughs> Let's go. I didn't actually remember that he was going to take control of the party, so I was not prepared for this. What? Okay. Sure. His ultimate attack is kind of pathetic. <laughs> Yeah, this is again why I'm playing on the easiest difficulty, so you don't have to rewatch fights. <laughs> this is the goofiest looking thing. I love the fact that everyone just kind of had gigantic question marks over their heads unless they got broke free of the control. That was actually pretty funny. Probably don't need it, but 
I didn't realize he still has rocket cards. I should get rid of that. I guess he got tired of using it. I think he does spam it. It's just not the only Let's thing go. he can do. It's a thing he will have priority in doing, though. <laughs> Let's actually use some electricity so I'm not dropping Conti's health. It's gonna do enough damage from the buff, the boost, so. It's probably very rare for him to use something other than this, which is why they think they, the wiki says he's going to spam it. Alright, you know what? Let's see if this will do it. Wind boosted Garudine, baby! Get out! And we got 5,000... We got... 5,500 experience from, for every character because I had the moon card still on. Ha, more power for me. EXP tastes so good. Damn it. Why? Well, he's not dead. That's a good start. Nanako-chan! She looks like she's in pain, but she doesn't seem to be injured anywhere. This place must not be good for her. We need to carry her out, quick! Actually, that's not a bad theory. This place is bad for teens without the glasses. We should take him with us as well. But a little kid without glasses? Yeah, we can't just leave him here, I guess. That'd be bad. Also, I want you to know I have the middle image of Kanji just grabbing his leg and dragging him along. So as we go down the stairs, you just hear Namatame go thunk, 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 thunk. Nanako-chan, hang in there. <laughs> what are we gonna do? Also, him throttling her probably didn't help. She's so small. And she was stuck in there for so long. So long. And then there was that weird fog. Damn it! Well, actually, it was overnight and through the school days. So that is quite a while. The police and paramedics will be here shortly. That actually probably is a long time for poor little Nanako. There's that weird fan noise again. Is it the hospital's AC? Nanachan's still small, so her other self didn't appear like everyone else. And she got caught in all that craziness. I hope she'll be okay. I mean, are the doctors going to be able to help her? Huh, that's interesting. I'm worried about Nana Chan. It's a really loud fan noise from the game all of a but sudden. There's nothing more we can do for her. I'm surprised you can't hear it. A delivery man named Namatame. The possibility of Nanako Chan being targeted. If only I'd been more thorough in putting the facts together, then Nanako Chan wouldn't have had to go through this. That goes for me too. If I hadn't stood there like a lump in front of that bastard. Nanako-chan might have been okay. I wonder why it's so loud in my headphones, then. I hate myself. Why do I always panic when it matters most? I couldn't do anything either. I should have noticed sooner that something was wrong with that guy. Why did I waste time listening to what Namatame had to say? If I hadn't tried to engage him in conversation, and we'd rescued Nanako-chan immediately... It wouldn't have changed. This wouldn't have happened. It still would have, Naoto. That would have changed the hour she but was in I there. Still... Nato. 
All right. Enough of this pity party. Is standing around and whining really what we ought to be doing now? Feeling pathetic, consoling each other? Is that gonna solve anything? We gotta believe in her. So stop rehashing what's already done. Get it together, Naoto! Sorry. You're absolutely right. This is all that bastard Namatame's fault. And he's behind bars now, right? And it ain't like we were too late for Nanako-chan. Yeah, that's true. I'll come see Nana-chan every day, so she'll get better faster. That's all we can do right now. Gee, Kanji. You sounded cool for a second there. Hey, Adachi. Huh? You guys still here? Adachi-san, um, did they find out anything? Dojima-san's speaking with the doctor now. They can't say anything definite until they run some tests on her. Not just Nanako-chan, but the perp too. Who knows when we'll be able to hear his story. Why is he? Well... Well, it's getting late, so hurry home. The last thing we need is for you guys to collapse too. I was like, why is he in trouble? Then I realized we did kind of brutalize him. Not his shadow, him. And he did kind of get possessed. He's right. We should call it a night. Nanako-chan's gonna be fine. Acting all gloomy won't help anything. When Nanako-chan's out of the hospital, what should we do to celebrate? Dude, isn't it a little early for that? No. Why don't we reserve Juness and have a party there? I don't think you can reserve a department a store. A party at Juness? Yukiko. Uh, that makes no sense. Teddy? You okay? Nanachan. She'll get better, right? Of course she will, Teddy. Yeah, I do believe in her. Let's all have fun with Nanachan when she comes back. Oh, Teddy, you're a cutie. Star is nearly maxed, and Teddy finally gets that endurer that I wanted him to have. Thanks. I almost forgot how to keep a happy face. But with that out of the way, I'm feeling all hungry. You're fine. <laughs> See, that's better, Teddy. Hey! Where did everyone go? Don't leave without me! Nanako will be fine, I'm sure. And now we've got time to burn. Also, I missed Sunday because of all that, but I don't think Tanaka was on, since that was a plot set time. And back to school like everything's normal. Um... Way to be a total creep. No, that was not a joke. You're creepy. I'd like to. Can we please report him? Uh... I think they were the same, but for some reason I want to say the North Pole. South Pole, I'm wrong on both accounts. <laughs> Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense.
I didn't realize that you could accumulate, you could make it colder by having land there. That's good to know. You're waiting for Nanako to recover. We got friends to hang out with. Yeah, yep, Naoto is available today. Senpai? Oh, Naoto. Today, tomorrow, or Wednesday. I don't know how close I am to maxing her. That might not be enough. But I'll have to go buy a... I don't think that's enough time to max, uh, max her out, but that just means I gotta keep going. Especially not when, uh... Oh yeah, so with Nanako and, and Dojima in the hospital, the music changes and you don't get a welcome home. It changes to something really mournful, as a matter of fact. I like it, but there's just honestly something really sad about it. Which makes sense, but... All envelopes because we can't work it. The hospital. And probably because the doctors would riot and throw Soji out the window if he worked at the hospital because he'd constantly be asking them about Nanako. <laughs> Good day. Yep. Thank you. I'm gonna have to go get Queen Mab again. <laughs> but I might spring for a higher lover so that I can do some better fusions. Yeah, 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 we need to recover. I am worried about Nanako, but like I know the text. It's the same as always. Go ahead, what's up? Huh, don't you live with him? Oh, that makes sense. That's a little suspicious. Jury to not rest or route for fable. Minus 40, minus 4. What? Minus 40, minus 4. Dash forty dash four. Huh? Nato, that's basic math. How did you miss that? <laughs> you subtract 40 and 4 from that? Like, 4 could be 4 fable, but where's the 40? Uh... 
Okay. Juness table. Let's go. So they stuck something at Juness? This seems like a really bad place to hide something, considering it's a public and well-trodden department store. Is that just me? Like, this just seems like a bad idea. How do you know that someone else wouldn't grab it, or one of the people cleaning up wouldn't grab it? Oh, the heels? Yeah, Naoto's uh, shoes have really thick soles and there's heels on them. She, the, she could actually probably walk through snow. The, the heels are thick enough. Also, Naoto, how do you make these things as a child? You're insanely good at creating things. <laughs> Because you get people to worry about, dummy. It does kind of make sense why this is the best option, though I still think you'll be you is a good one. But it didn't get you any points for some <laughs> reason. So and she should yeah, cause you're she can now cure severe ailments, good. <laughs> I certainly hope so. I'll see you again. Because the sooner I get her out of the way, the sooner I can get Risei out of the way, and hopefully that will actually be a thing I can do. Also, I find it so weird the music doesn't carry to the the second floor, and instead they do like dogs barking. Why did they do that? It's such a weird choice. I mean, this is probably Naoto again. Yep. Senpai. Oh, she's all stuttery. Thank you. Yes. And by next you mean the only other lover's flag because there's only there's only two. And for what I know of the description apparently this is actually quite uh this actually isn't bad so it seems like my thought for having to treat Naoto poorly was either an incorrect guide or because you can be a total horrible person to her in her social link. And you can be a, a pretty terrible person to her while dating her as well. So that's probably what I was thinking of. Way to spoil the social link there, Mav. It, it's okay. I, I do wish you hadn't said that, but like we're gonna find out in a few minutes, so it's not that big a deal. 
I just prefer letting things play out first with stuff like this. talking about social links but try to keep stuff like that in your pocket until after it's over especially considering it's not much it's not very long to wait if we're on the rank itself so I mean he hit something in Juness I don't think unnoticed is really his big goal here so far, they've all been in pretty distinctly public places. Yep, so you need to hit number one here and protect Naoto, like Maverick said, to start the lover relationship. You had to have tripped the other flag earlier in the... Uh, dialogue by saying you're glad she was a girl for this to work. Senpai. If you have not uh, picked the flag, it will not start the lover's relationship. You need to hit both of them. <laughs> oh, that, that knife is a toy, so I'm just like, what? <laughs> you played the distinct music. Naoto's mad at us. You don't actually get... You don't actually get any points in this uh, decision at all. Also, you can see Naoto's issue with gender roles here again. She, think that, she thinks that uh, accepting she's female means getting protected by a man. Rather than the fact that Soji's just protecting her because he likes her. <laughs> like, huh? he'd protect all of his friends, Naoto. He loves you, but you're not... He's not protecting you just because you're a girl, so you um... don't swing that way. I do kind of like the fact that she gets upset because it shows she's still trying to grapple with uh, her problems. Um. Oh, she's all blushy. Isn't she cute? So yeah, we are now on the lover's route, though being Naoto, it's going to be a little awkward. It's okay because she is uh, beyond a doubt best girl in game. I still think best housewife in game would go to Kanji though. I mean, he sews, he cooks, he cleans, he paints. What more could you want? Yeah, it does kind of seem like you did something wrong at first, but you didn't. She's just very embarrassed and flees. Though the fact that she's not going to be available tomorrow actually makes that scene fit a lot better. Also, don't, I don't know why it keeps repeatedly popping up the oh Sayako's not there anymore thing like we know Sayako's not there we don't need to check the social link we got another 800 bucks 80 bucks not 800 80 bucks for stuffs 
Who is it this time? Oh, Naoto is available today. Senpai. I mean, thank you. I'm not gonna complain. Like I said, the sooner I can max her out, the sooner I can stop worrying about it. And then I can go after Risa to finally get all the time-locked ones done. And then work on everyone else I need to work on. Which I believe would be I and Naoki. Oh, and Temperance as well. But I think I have time for all of them. If I bring the Persona with me and get the choices right. Apologize. Alright, we got to help Naoto out a lot, so I don't mind. I did what you can't stand to at a place you'd be fond of. Huh, this card seems rather straightforward. But underneath rather than inside. Well, relatively to others. So he's done something she doesn't like at a place she would like and underneath instead of inside of something. A place she would be fond of, I believe, is high places. But I don't remember when she said this. I know she said it somewhere, but I don't remember where she said it. I wouldn't Okay, I was I wouldn't really call just having a tree house the hint, but she's but yeah, I, I remember that now. And the what she can't stand to do, she actually told us just a couple of links ago. She can't stand throwing things away. Yes. She's really embarrassed that we actually remember stuff about her. It's cute. Yeah, she mentioned it twice, but she's also mentioned it just, like, within the past three social links. So if you're doing her as you're supposed to do her, that's easier to remember than the High Places one, I think. Especially because the High Places one can have a whole dungeon between it and this, so you might have already forgotten. face. She's just so cute. Naoto, hon. You can't control that. That's other people's problems. You don't need to take that on yourself, sweetie.
She's seriously a sweetheart. She lost her way with the awful way other people were treating her, but... I think she found it again. At the very least, she's on the right track to finding that path again. It'll no doubt be work, but she knows what she needs to do. I'm proud of you, Naoto. One who is seeking the truth with you and the others. I'm really proud of her. <laughs> and now she can endure. She's almost ready to be the full party member. Don't worry too much about Teddy. He will get to rank 10 before the final before the next dungeon. So uh Both of these two will be perfectly fit for fighting by the time we get there and things will be easier. Oh, isn't she a cutie? Also, one heartbreaking thing is that if you cheat on the girls and you turn Naoto down for, like, Valentine's Day, she knows you're cheating, but she outright tells you to your face that she can't ask because she knows what the answer is and she can't tolerate hearing the answer, so she just pretends it's not the case. It's a sign of Soji being a scumbag forcing them into the fog. Which uh, I thought was actually an interesting spin on it. That's the thing is it's, it's that makes it heartbreaking is Naoto just turns her eyes away from what she knows is the truth because she doesn't want to believe it. She lets Soji lie to her, and that's more heartbreaking than a woman scorn thing. It just, it's awful. Though I can't really imagine why you would intentionally two-time in a dating sim. That just kind of makes you a gross person. Like, if you stumble into it or the game makes you, like, Persona 3, that's not really your fault. But if you're doing it knowingly... Eh. I have no idea. Wouldn't it call? I was kind of tuning her out. <laughs> I just sort of do that when Kashiwaga's on the screen. I just sort of tune it out. No. No, no, no. Oh, thank God. She went back to the textbook. No emophilically hitting on students in the hallway. I actually didn't get the pop-up. Alright. 
So if Naoto is not available, I have to go to the Fox because it's raining and Risei is not. And she is not. So it's going to be a day with the Fox then. Yeah, I agree with that. I just, I don't know why. I just find the, the thing of, I just find the thing of no insert weird and out of the ordinary thing here in the hallway joke hilarious. Like no dismembering ball, like a teacher walking up and going no dismembering balls, no dismembering bodies in the hallway sort of thing. I just find those kind of hilarious. So let's see if this is just going to give me the rank up I wanted. It seems like it will. Hey, Foxy! What you trying to tell me? Yeah, you do just have to do another time slot after turning in the Inma to get it maxed out. Oh, worried about the box? Let's see here. Oh, it's empty. That's why. Where'd your money go? Uh, construction crew? Uh, that seems like a waste. Wouldn't shouldn't you make the building better first? Um. Also, this seems very wasteful. Like the offertory box, sure, but the Tori. I feel like the shrine, it's, the shrine building itself, could have used an upgrade better. Most foxy without me here. Oh, he's cute. I have forged a bond that cannot be broken with the fox. <laughs> a wild fox, in fact. Honestly, I, as frustrating as this social link is, I find it kind of cute. Yep, we can now pray at the shrine to increase social link points. And it is now only 15 yen per SP, which is the cheapest it's gonna get.
Oh, we don't get to see the cute thing. I wonder if that's just in golden. And we have rain with here, so... No sad music. We'll briefly save. And we're gonna make more money, money, money. Is that only in golden? No, I meant what I was looking for. Hey, Nato. She's so blushy. thinking of is that in the golden epilogue the fox actually gives birth to a bunch of cubs and they're the cutest thing in the world but I can't find a picture of them and it makes me sad uh, that depends what do you want to mention not so sweetie you okay you seem to be, uh, very stressed out, hon. But... Oh, no, Otto. You silly cutie. If you're really not sure, you can just tell me in the private Discord and I'll let you know. Please accept it. Oh, she made it to Detective Badge! That would actually have been really cool! <laughs> and I love it, Naoto. Anybody who says it's childish or stupid, I will fight them. I will knock their teeth out. So here's the stuff that I find kind of gross. You... This isn't the only one. Later she'll ask you... I think it's only in Golden, but she'll ask you what you think of her clothing, and you can tell her that you want her to dress more girly. And I just find it kind of... Yes. 
Because it feels like you're trying to force her out of her comfort zone to make her more traditionally feminine, and it just feels gross and skeevy. And now she should be immune the most to both of the instant death elements. Still a fairy with the still a fairy, but this time it's got an actual sword instead of a lightsaber. And long hair apparently. I actually never noticed the long hair. Yeah, go ahead and say it, whatever you were thinking. If I remember correctly, she looks incredibly uncomfortable the whole time, which just makes me feel even skeevier about it. I mean, I guess an argument can be made that she's directly asking you what you think and you're just being honest, but I, I can't read it that way. It just feels really off to me. Though I can kind of understand why other people might read it that way, I just don't like the idea that the masculine female character has to be pushed to be more feminine or it's not as good. Personally, I like her better in her suit than in the Seifuku. I think she looks better in it. I know, but... It... <sighs> It's one of those things where I can see the innocent implication and I can see where people get it, but I just don't feel that way. <laughs> I'm not the same as Naoto in that I didn't pretend to be a boy, but I had a very masculine way of dressing when I was in high school. And a lot of people pushed me hard to dress more femininely, so stuff like that just kind of makes, makes me feel skeeved. So I love you too, Naoto. I will say that at least there is the fact that it can be innocent. I just... I just personally can never read it as innocent. It, Unlike the cheating... I'm just gonna stop rambling now. <laughs> What are you danging it about? I probably should have saved. Oh well. Sunday resay will actually be available, so. <laughs> I'd like that a lot if that could actually happen, but sadly no. Everything else aside, I honestly think Naoto just looks looks her best, the way she's drawn in masculine clothing. And it might just be that comfort thing. Uh... Like, Yukiko looks best very femininely, but I think Nata looks best with her natural style. I will say that if I did have the choice to change something about her wardrobe, I'd drop the hat more often. She's much cuter without the hat. Okay. Firstly, I want to stick these prize stickers in there. 
Maybe get some of my homunculi back. Secondly, I want to pawn off all this stuff. Hydaelyn here. Something probably useless. And these extra accessories aren't even worth any decent yen. Come on. If you're gonna repeat accessories endlessly, at least make them worth yen. gonna use that. Yeah, right? That's the other reason I don't really like opening gold chests. Is even is if you don't get anything good, then you don't get anything good. What is this? Not worth it. Definitely not worth it. What about the armor? Teddy's, uh, Teddy's armor was really outdated. No wonder he got so bad. Well, it cost me a pretty penny, but now everyone's got up-to-date armor. The weapons were... Well, we have, we have better, like, in our pockets, so... Alright. I can now toss out Fortuna because... We are finished with Naoto's social link. It's cause the the problem was that he had it in the last dungeon. So I was thinking, oh, I'll just upgrade his armor when I'm finished rerunning that dungeon because then I will have had more options. So I can get him just a much better piece of armor in one swoop. And I forgot to do that. <laughs> I forgot to pick up the extra armor after the dungeon you observed it in. Nimbus is weak to a lot of things. Alright, lovers, lovers. You know, yeah, we'll get you for better fusing materials. That explains why Teddy was getting so hammered, though. <laughs> that was a big whoopsie on my end. I didn't realize that I forgot to upgrade him that long. Alright, back to Rise. You know what? That actually sounds innocent, considering what she said before. Risa really is polarizing. Uh huh. When she's not having, when she's not like her bad spots, she seems to be a pretty good character. 
But her bad spots are so bad. <laughs> We know that I can pray at the shrine. I'll just pray to boost somebody up when I'm, uh, when it's rainy. thing to say, Rise, even in context. Like, I get she doesn't mean anything <laughs> bad by it, but it's still- and I don't falter for that one. That is kind of creepy to say. Hey look, it's the rip-off discount Shinji again. Kind of min? Is there some reason they give them weird, cutesy nicknames? were smart. Well, no, let me amend that. Nobody said teenagers in general were smart as a whole. Say. Not something I think I'd ever say, to be honest, but poor Rise. It's alright, you don't gotta freak out, darling. I understand. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Oh, okay, so she's at the end of the week. Oh, doesn't doesn't Naoki go from Monday to Thursday? No, oh, but I need to max her out before the end of November, so I can't Yeah, I could do Naoki then and then Rise then and just take eye on the days where uh, she appears when Naoki shows up. Though I'm gonna need to get some space <laughs> for a hanged man and a moon. At least with Naoto finished, the immensely pressing one isn't too bad. Rise was already pretty heavily progressed. So we shouldn't have much issue finishing her off. to say, but if it makes you feel better, that's really all that matters. <laughs> oh. You weren't being creepy, so I actually didn't mind. <laughs> you see how that works, Rise? When you act like a normal human being, I don't mind being around you.
As long as you keep I'll your hands... You later, keep your hands to yourself and above the waist, lady. I wish there was an easier indication to realize if you could go to, like, the janitor thing than just checking or memorizing the days. Oh well. It's not like it takes long. So I'm gonna need to make space to grab a hangman and a moon. <laughs> So I think I'm actually going to go ahead and cut the stream here. We've been going for another two hours. And I can make room easily if I start fusing the stuff I have that I need to fuse. So. I'll handle that. And next time we'll progress more and maybe get to the to uh, actual plot again. Hooray! 